Hey, and welcome to Papa Dre's video blog. I was thinking I'm, I'm going to start video blogging. And I'm going to do it in English so everyone can follow it. Uh, but, uh, and I, yeah, I know, I got the beard. I had a beard funeral this morning and I was... Uh, I, I'm not really satisfied with this at all. But, um, I don't know, I felt like I have to remove the beard. So I did, and I, I kind of regret myself afterwards. I'm sorry. These blogs will be done from my kitchen or like the living room or something so my kids could come in or you could hear screams. Or my wife could come in, of course. So it will be pretty much like when I write. I just do whatever I do straight up and I don't spell check or whatever. It's just me. So um, let's talk a little bit about the broadcast last week or actually this week still it was amazing really amazing because I looked forward to this for 10 years you could say like for 10 years I wanted to pay my bills uh, doing Dota things and even though I've been a pro and I played a lot and um, and I had good teams and I had a lot of wins I've never been able to do that and now I can at least for a little while and uh, I appreciate that a lot. It's a long travel. <laughs> not, not that long, it takes three hours, but it's long for me. I mean, I, I have to go up, go up early to be able to get back to work. I have taken some days off my regular work, of course, but uh, sometimes I have to like go up early as hell and then go back here to my town and, and go to work for like 24 hours. So it's gonna be a rough month this November. <laughs> without a doubt, but I don't care. I, I really want to do this and I, I really don't care. Yeah And th the thing that we were mer at least I was most ner nervous about was the, the discussion discussion about the Swedish language because Some people say that it's like it's like cheeky or, or I don't know uh, Corny or whatever speaking Swedish about Dota and I was really worried about that too because that has happened at, at occasions when you heard people have interviews or discussions or even newspaper uh, like news about Dota and, and, and when you try to, to talk about the game in Swedish it, I don't know it gets cheesy and I was worried about that but I, I thought a lot, lot about it and I wrote an, a thing about it on my blog as well because it's really something wrong with us not the language it's it's we the fans who, who haven't realized that shit Dota is so big so we can we can talk about it in Swedish and and it's really not cheesy or corny it's cool it's awesome it's fucking amazing that we finally came to this part of, 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 of the Dota growing so big so we can speak Swedish I, I just think it's amazing I, I still remember when we were at Dreamhack and we played I think we played Zenith I was playing with uh, SK then, so it was probably me and, and Laura and Ake yeah, and Quam and Tompa. And we played Zenith and, and I asked one guy how much viewers we had. And back then we had the GT client, I don't know if, you, if you're all familiar with that, but that was like the first client who could, who could make, like, who, where you could follow the games live. And we had 2,000 people following us live and I was like, wow, this game has grown. It's amazing like that and now it's it's not even six years after that we're broadcasting Dota in Swedish national television on the play channel yes 26 play first but the finals will go on the real TV and I, I don't think I think it's I don't think it's a big deal if it's the, the real TV or if it's a play channel because people watch streams anyway but of course it, it's some kind of recognition that it goes on the real TV as well so I like that a lot. So when I came home I asked my wife what did you think about the broadcast and she said it was amazing. But she had one thing that she didn't like and that's the way people say my name. So we're gonna have a little small course about it. My name is actually not Dreisch as many of the people says. And my son's name is not Drei. No. It's Drei. And Dreisch. I don't know how, how I can explain that easier in English. If you say the word day and then you put an R between the D and the R, uh, like A, and see what happens. Dre, sh. And that's, then, yeah, that sounds sh. 
Drei, sh, drei, sh. You can practice at home with friends. Uh, <laughs> it's not that hard. It's really not that hard. And my wife made this point because she was like, can't Swedish people say your name correctly? I said, I don't think anyone can do that. So start doing that. Dreish, Dreish, Papa Dreish. Nice, good work. Well, uh, this is my first vlog. I'm gonna go to work really soon. I have this long shift and then I have a wedding photography tomorrow and then I have more work in the studio and then I have a regular work again and then I have the radio. So I'm so busy right now and I love it. Uh, it's a little bit stressful. No, not, that, not a little bit stressful. It's really stressful, but hey, who can complain really because right now so many people don't even have a job and I have so much to do and I'm, I'm like I have this feeling that people like what I do when I do it too and that's just a blessing so I, I, I don't want to complain but I'm really stressed I am I am really stressed and I have to like in some way make a deal with myself what I'm gonna what I want to do with my future and, 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 and well you don't want to listen to this that's just not interesting and I'm sorry about the beard I, I come to the, came to the conclusion that I probably have to make a lot of funnier jokes now because my character like died when I removed the beard and I looked like a boy a really small boy again so I don't know what to do and, and it probably won't grow out until next broadcast so well I have to live with it I guess anyway thanks for tuning in guys um, uh, and of course don't miss out the TV6 uh, broadcast every Wednesday now until the last one it is more uh, month then we go to dream Act and then we send uh, we will broadcast the finals and that's gonna be awesome bye bye